Yes! How's this? Very nice. Yes! Sure. <laughs> So, different materials produce different weapons, each with their own respective properties. We should probably move on. Come to think of it, what's my sword made of? What material would it make sense with? Claws? Fangs? In one ear and out the other. Looks like we get to sleep with a roof over our heads. here ever again. Hey there, Doc. Hmm? Who are you? It's me, Iron Mask. Though these days I go by Alfin. I finally remembered my name. Alfin? I heard that was the guy who brought down Balsif. Wait. You're telling me you're the liberator of Calaglia? Our own Iron Mask? Of all the people. I told you, I'm Alpha now. And I didn't overthrow Balsef alone. Even so, that's no small feat you've accomplished. And you managed to get your face back, too. That woman with you, the Renin? You know about her. Only what I've heard from rumors. I wasn't sure I believed it. But now I suppose I must. Doc, she... Thank you. You sure you should be saying that to a Renin? I'm not saying it to any old Renin. I'm saying it to you, young lady. I only helped because it was in my interests as well. Of course, I would imagine as much. But that doesn't change the end result. The two of you defeated Balsef, and now all of us are free. That is a fact. Thanks, Doc. I should be the one thanking you. I'll never be able to repay what you two have done. Anyway, I'm guessing you didn't come here just to catch up. Uh, right. We need your advice. We found a girl who's collapsed from exhaustion, and she needs medicine. Do you know anything that could help? Hmm. If she's that weak, she may need a nutritional boost. The herbs I have here won't be enough. Oh! Have you tried searching Kirt Garrison? No. We passed it on our way here, but... With all the Renin soldiers gone, that place should be empty now. If we're lucky, maybe they left something you can use. Good idea. We'll take a look. Kirt Garrison. If I'm not mistaken, that's located off to the side of the railroad tracks. Wherever it is, just make it quick.
You look happy. Do I? I guess I am. Getting thanked for everything by someone I actually know? It made it really hit home that we made a difference. That guy's a strange one, though. Doc? I don't think he's that odd. He is, though. He thanked me, a Renan, for helping. Despite everything my people have put him through over the years. He's free now. He doesn't have to act nice around my kind. He's not acting. He means it. And like he said before, he was thanking you as an individual, Xion. Not just some Renan. That's what makes it so strange. Would you have preferred he yelled and threw rocks at you? I'm not saying that. It's just... hard for me to understand him. <sighs> We've reached our destination. You're slacking. Step Sorry, it up. Stop. Uh, there. Yeah. Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. Right. Here goes. Seven wings. It's over. You're on. Uh, this Jedi one's all mine. Looks like it could be worth something. Looks like this place opens out into the ocean. The water's so much cleaner than what's on the surface. I even see fish swimming around. Yeah, and boy do they look delicious. What? N never mind. Like this should be easy. Mega Ray! By the Kya! power of water! Severing wind! Here I go! Try over. this! Infernal turret! This could be useful. of the trash. Sonic come one, come all! Severing wind! Reload! Wind! There! Help me! We 
did it! These I little ones are hardly worth that time. Less talking, more pummeling. Let's keep our eyes on the prize. Like this should be easy. Blade. Reload! Try this! Blade. Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. Heal me. To stop you dying? Ah, oh, right. Sonic Thrust! Win! We're in good form! An opponent like this should be easy. Here I go! One more! We're in good form. Think this is it? How would I know? It matches the description we were given, at least. No use standing around here hemming and hawing. Let's take it back and see. I hope you're right. There's no way I'm coming all the way back here. Just to be safe, I think before we head back to Ulzebek, we should maybe have Doc double check this is the right stuff. All right, but let's make it quick. Did you find anything useful? We think this might work, but we wanted you to take a look at it first. Let's see. Ah, this stuff. Yes, this'll work. I'd hurry over and give it to the girl right away. Right. Then we'll do that now. 
Say, Iron Mask. No, sorry. It's Alfin now, right? Are you and that young woman planning to stick together moving forward? Uh, yeah, I think so. You know, I think things just might be starting to change. What do you mean? I'm not sure of that myself. But I feel like after being stalled for a long time, the gears of progress are finally starting to turn again. I imagine people are going to have things to say about the two of you. But you simply keep doing what you feel is right. If you ever get tired and need to rest, feel free to come back here. Until then, take care of yourself. Thanks, Doc. There's no point in reading it unless you plan on making it. Off we go. on the pro Bye.
you. Win! You're mine! Mirage! Try this! Demon Fang! You're mine! By the You're power mine. I can't lay a finger on you! I prefer it that way. What about you? Barely a blip on our radar. Is this what you asked for? Perfect. That'll do nicely. I had a feeling you'd come through for us. With this, the little one should be right as rain in no time. I can't believe it. Not often we get visitors from Cislodia around here. Cislodia? Calaglia's neighbor. One of the five realms. What with that wall in the way, I guess it's not surprising. But... I've never actually met someone from the outside world before. Up till now, the only time the gates ever opened was to let Renan convoy units in and out. No one ever thought to stow away and hitch a ride out? This place might be a living hell, but when next door is a living hell too, you start thinking it doesn't matter much one way or the other. So you're Rinwell, and you're with the Cislodian resistance known as the Silver Swords. Your organization sent a group of you to establish contact. But you're the only one who made it through. That sound about right? Lately, our people's oppression has become more and more severe. When we heard rumors that you had staged a successful rebellion in Calaglia, we hoped that maybe you could help us. News sure gets around quickly, huh? If you ask me, it's awfully convenient she just happened to show up now certainly raises a lot of red flags. Please, I swear it's true! My people are dying! I risked my life trying to get here so I could find help. It's okay. You did well. We'll take it from here. <laughs> Hold on, Zephyr. You're not really thinking... We'll join her. Alfin, start getting ready. I let you use the Blazing Sword, and we work together to overthrow the Lords. That was the deal, remember? Wait, is that a Renan? What is this? Take it easy. It's complicated, but she's on our side. She helped to find some medicine for you. She did? But no, she's a... I, I can't believe it. The Renans from other realms could attack at any time. That's for you all to worry about. I've got bigger fish to fry. That sword of Alfin's is our best weapon. We can't just go lending him to other lands. Even if you keep him here, the blade's as good as useless without me on board. And what makes you think I can't persuade you, Bright Eyes? What makes you think you can? Last I checked, you couldn't even touch me. Enough! Alfin, what do you want to do? I... I know all too well the hardships the slaves of this realm had to endure. That's why I took up the sword. To help them. If Danans are being oppressed in other realms, then... then I have to help them too. Nath has a point. We can't discount the possibility of further attacks. But now, our struggle has grown. It's become much larger than just liberating the people of Calaglia. We can't be in two places at once, Zephyr. True. Which means we're limited in our options. We play this the same way we did with Balsef.
I have a bad feeling about this. You and me both, but it's too late for regrets. Jeez, really? You don't say. So, you're really going, huh? Just the four of you? Uh, afraid so. Look after the place while we're away. <laughs> Always the smooth talker. We'll do what we can to hold down the fort. We've got the Renans to keep us busy. Good luck. Just remember... Yeah, yeah, don't go killing anyone without good reason, I get it. I'm not about to repeat what they did. Let's move, people. Do you think we'll really be able to wipe the Renans off the face of Dana? Who said anything about doing that? But we have to in order to survive. Don't we? Now that you have the Blazing Sword, and have shown that we really can win this fight, do you really think we should go around killing every last Renan? But what else are we supposed to do? Say we go around killing Renans, so they don't kill us first. In turn, that'll just make more and more of them want to kill us. Where does it end, once you enter such a vicious cycle? Is that why you told Grenar not to kill any Renans without a good reason? I'm not saying we should forgive and forget what they've done to us. But we can't let ourselves be dragged down by our own hatred either. Hatred comes in many forms. And there's no one solution that will work in every situation. We have to keep searching for new ones, if we're going to survive. It's a lifelong journey, finding the answers. That goes for you too. You have to come up with your own answers. Hey Zephyr, why do you keep fighting? What do you mean? Until I met you and the Crimson Crows, all the Danans I ever knew just accepted their lot in life as slaves. Hell, even I was like that. But all of you in the Resistance are different. Even when you have no hope of winning, you keep on fighting. Why is that? Come on, that's an easy one. I just refuse to live life as a slave, that's all. Better to die fighting for freedom than to live as a slave, huh? Let me ask you a question, Alfin. What does it mean to you to not be a slave any longer? I guess it means living a life not being ruled by the Renans, right? But what about the Danans who died standing up to the Renans? Are they still slaves? <sighs> Would they be truly free if all they did was follow my orders and die without knowing what it was they were doing? But that's... Being a slave isn't just a position. It's also a state of mind. Don't become my slave, Alfin. <laughs> <laughs>